Hi guys, we're here at the Texas Auto Riders, Texas Auto Roundup at Texas Motor Speedway. I'm here with Ashton Munoz. He is from Dodge. He is full of information. He's a lot of fun. You can actually see him if you come to almost any Dodge event. It's amazing. Okay, he's going to tell y'all, let's back up. Okay, y'all asked for a Hellcat. You asked for a video of Hellcat. I am complying. This is what we're about to do. We are in the Dodge Challenger SRT Superstock. Now, it's a Hellcat, yes? This is based off the Hellcat Red Eye engine. So it's got the, starts off at the 797 horsepower engine. Uh -huh. With the Superstock, we added 10 more horsepower to it, <gasps> along with a bunch of other drag racing specific features. Uh -huh. So our goal for this car was to make it the fastest muscle car in the quarter mile. And it is. It runs a ten mile, uh, quarter mile in a 10.5 seconds. Oh. 800, 807 horsepower, 707 foot-pounds of torque. Okay. And this car has a bunch of drag-specific features on it. So 315 drag radials on all four corners, so super sticky. Okay. Smaller brakes up front to maximize the weight, uh, keep weight out of the front of the car mm -hmm. on the drag strip. Okay. Um, and you don't need as big of a brake on the drag strip either. Uh, specially tuned limited slip diff in the rear. Mm -hmm. And... Uh, it it has a bunch of technology that uh, comes from the demon and our red eyes cut like you can cool the supercharger down just using the air conditioner uh -huh. um, you can shut the car off after you race and everything can will still you know keep circulating coolant throughout the car and bring it actually down below ambient air and temperature. So there's a bunch of cool racing specific features on this car. But you can use it in everyday life too. So it'll be ready for the yep. track strip, but also for everyday life. And it is. So like you said, it's it's based off a of Hellcat and a Red Eye, which are our street cars. It has a little bit of the demon features on it. That was our, our really drag specific car, but uh -huh. it's, a, it's a nice medium in between where you get the fastest muscle car. But uh -huh. like you said, you can take it on the highway, take it on the street. I mean, it has different modes in it. This will be just like any normal car if you say I it love to. that and okay y'all aren't in it which you really want to be but you've got comfortable seating look at this okay there is this beautiful leather Laguna leather seats um, we've got Alcantara package on it so it's got the Alcantara inserts and the Alcantara steering wheel which is nice for grip on the track beautiful textures it looks good real, car guys. real carbon fiber carbon fiber it's wipeable guys you're gonna love this so if you want something that can go track street home you want to look fabulous while you do it or it still looks just like you're being freaking fantastic let's do this okay so we're about to do what you asked for we're about to put this car on the track ready let's go let's go you ready uh-huh oh, can you believe it we're at texas motor speedway <laughs> we'll put it in track mode too for you guys do you hear that sound all right we're off ready ready <laughs> First slalom. First one, second. First corner. <gasps> okay. First cone. Wait, you hear turn. that sound? Oh my gosh. It's the sound. It's magnificent. The car is solid, long. guys. It's steady. It, it's made for this. But the car is feels doesn't feel like it's fragile. It can handle a lot of abuse. All these SRTs go through strenuous testing. But that's what you wanted a muscle car. And we're talking like an American muscle car. That's what this is. Wait, turn. Oh my gosh, there we go. All the way to the outside. It's absolutely beautiful. Next cone. Next cone. There's the next one. And slalom, slalom. again. Okay, we Hard picked break. up some speed and the brakes work. Thank you, Lord. <laughs> Because <laughs> what uses it to go fast if you can't slow down? Oh, it's Smooth great. in the corner. Y'all, it's a Outside. beautiful ride. The car is solid. I'm not feeling all merged around, but we've got some speed. And that's it. off. There we go. In. <laughs> Last corner. Last one. Cone. Gosh, that was amazing. We're so lucky. You hear I the, love it. The sticky tires throwing all the rocks up right now. I do hear that it. That helped on the corners, definitely, the drag radials. That was fantastic. All right, we just got off the track. 
Now we're gonna talk about this car. This is the Challenger, yay! Okay, so we talked about it and I love that you can get this car in a variety of price points. It just so happens we brought the one um, on the top of the crazy level mm -hmm. and also the price range. Um, but you can get different versions of these Challengers, you know, all the way down to right over, right over 30 grand. Which is fantastic. And they all come with safety features, the traction control. So you still get the fun just at whatever price point you want to have it at. All right. So tell me more about this. So this is our super stock. This is our, our drag strip performance machine. Uh -huh. uh, we built this thing to be the fastest muscle car. And right now it is the fastest muscle car. It runs 10.5 in the quarter mile uh -huh. um, right from the factory. So it, it allows us to, to run that quick. It has a lot of drag, uh, drag racing specific features on it. Okay. So with that being said, it's got the red eye engine in it, which starts off at 797. With the super stock, you get 10 extra horsepower. So it bumps it up to 807 horse. <gasps> That's so much power. Along with that power though, we have to put it to the ground somehow. So on all four corners of this super stock, there's uh, three 15 width drag radials. So they're super sticky. Um, they help the car get the traction to get that 10.5 second quarter mile. Uh -huh. Along with the drag radials too, we did a few drag racing tricks. So we want to try to keep the weight out of the front. Okay. We put the smaller brakes on this one. So most of our Hellcats and our Red Eyes have the big six piston brakes. Mm -hmm. It's good for the track for, you know, multiple stopping. So if you use that in everyday life, are you going to, is it going to make it more complicated or is it still no, just not at all and these are uh these are way better than just normal brakes you'd find on any regular car these are the four piston brembos so the car still uh, has a lot of stopping capabilities uh -huh. but for the drag strip you don't need a huge brake on the front and it helps saves weight on the front of the vehicle to push it all to the rear i love that so inside this as you know most of our audience we have families so it has a real back seat guys like you can actually put your kids in the back seat so say you're sitting at carpool you get to be extra fantastic it actually fits five adults in the car and i've done it so i'm not just talking about you're it not gonna not pretend. it's not pretend so you don't have to squish your head and you have you do have the squeeze uh-huh okay so we've got this guys so this is what you asked for if there's more questions you have about this car or any more about the challenger lineup dm me let me know and then we will ask ashton back perfect Awesome. Thanks, y'all. Thanks, guys. Bye.